Hello guys and welcome to another tutorial video. In this short tutorial video, I'll be showing you how to buy crypto on Jupyter Exchange. All right, so you can go about this by opening up a wallet that supports the Solana network. We mainly make use of the Phantom wallet, but you can make use of Soulflare or the Trust wallet or any wallet in general that supports the Solana network. So once you've opened up a wallet, let's go with the Phantom wallet for today's video. Make sure you have some Solana on your wallet. If you do not have Solana on your wallet, use the receive icon to simply receive your Solana via your QR code or copying the wallet address. You could also make use of the buy option to buy your Solana tokens using your credit card. So simply click on Solana or search for Solana, enter an amount of so you like to buy and then click on continue. All right. So once you've gotten yourself some Solana, which is actually important for this tutorial, head over to the magnifying glass icon at the bottom right where it says sites tokens url at the top simply search for jupiter and where it says DeFi, simply search for jupe where it says DeFi. click on DeFi, and then click on open you then be taken to jupe.ag which is the website for uh, this uh, tutorial where we're going to be connecting our wallet to all right so my wallet has been automatically connected but at the top right corner just click here and then go ahead and click on connect to connect your wallet to the platform. Once your wallet has been connected, uh, in order to buy tokens, you're going to have to swap. So you can sell a particular token to gain a particular token. That's how the buying works. So you're selling USDC and buying Solana, but you're going to need Solana to cover your gas fees. So in this case, we can then go ahead and just swap their places and sell Solana and buy USDC. So let's say for five Solana, you're getting this amount of USDC. All you need to do now is simply click on swap and the transaction is completed. So guys, that's how you can easily go about this. Comment down below if you have a question and don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel.